Hello everyone, today it is me, back again, Phil Bear, um, with another Meet My Pet. This is my ninth Meet My Pet, and I have another baddie for you. This, her back's looking a little snarky, but this is a toad. She is my standard eared, female, gray hooded, gray hooded, um, rat fancy rat. She is my oldest rat. Well, her and Gambit, my first be my pet. Um, she is amazing. Um, I got her from these amazing people. You say amazing. These amazing people um, for my 17th birthday. So literally almost a year that I've had her. And she was a little over two when I got her. So, she is an old girl, but I love her so much. She's been through quite a bit. I've done a couple cage switches around with her, um, introducing all my babies to her um, in the cage. She's had some war wounds with one of my other rats. In fact, Oreo, this is the toad that I was talking about in my Meet My Pet Oreo. Um, we were doing play, like out of cage time. This is when I was trying to introduce the two cages together. Um, and they were fine. I would have out of cage time together and then they'd go back to the separate cages so they can introduce them slowly. And she got really, I think she was just trying to groom, but got a little too aggressive or something like that and went after her. She actually has a scar. I don't know if the camera will be able to show you that lump right there. That is a piece of fat that was actually hanging out of her. Um, so we did some research and stuff and found out what we can do to make her heal quickly, like quicker, um, because it happened at like 10 o'clock at night and all the vets near me were closed. So my mom and I did some <laughs> emergency medical stuff. We stopped the bleeding with some sterile gauze. Um, and then my mom did some research on what um, intestines look like outside of it to make sure that it was just fat and not her intestines because if it was we know she wouldn't have made it. Luckily it was just a piece of fat and all the websites we went on like a vet website and everything like that and they said for the first couple of days if it doesn't start looking like there's an improvement take them to the vet. Um, so that's what we did, and we could see her stomach healing. She loves kisses. She loves giving kisses. Um, we could see that her stomach was healing nicely and everything, so she's all better now. She's not too happy. Her cage is full. <laughs> Thank you. Cage is full of babies, because she's, like, the oldest one in there. Her gambit, Batty, our Batty is probably will be one of my last Meet My Pets because her taste is really weird right now. Um, but yes, that is my amazing little ratty toad. Um, yeah, I almost actually hurt one of my neighbors the other day, uh, probably about last week. So I had Toad on my shoulder outside, and his, like, my neighbor's husband was totally fine. He was like, rats, blah, 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 they clean. And I'm like, yes, they clean themselves as much as, as cats. But his wife started saying that we should send them to a lab to be tested on as, like, medical experiments and, like, research things for, like, makeup and stuff. And I'm like, no, my rats will never be tested on. They are pets. They all give a lot of kisses. Thank you. And they're mine. 
I'm now up to 10 rats. So you'll be seeing all of them. Anyway, once again, have a lovely day and I will see you next time. Bye.